I learned to walk when I was one beneath the Oklahoma sun. And from that day, I started taking my own route. I learned to read when I was two, and I believed it all was true. Too young to fill my mind with questions and with doubt. I made my first friend when I was three, but by four he moved away so very far from me. At five I wondered why people live and people die, and why the things I love just slowly slipped away from me, and only stars remain the same. Starlight, we are not alone. Cold night, starlight, we are not alone. We're together on our own. I said goodbye when I was ten. Santa Claus and all his friends. I had to leave those childish stories all behind. But when they told me God was real, I just couldn't help but feel this burning question that was tugging on my mind. By the time I was eleven, I had given up on heaven, and everything was falling into place. I kept my mouth shut so I wouldn't rock the boat. Because a kid who's fallen overboard is just too ashamed to float. And still the stars remain the same. Together on our own. I learned to walk when I was one. Without a crutch to lean upon, I had to relearn everything. My legs were weak without the wings, but I'm stronger now. My mind is free, controlling my own destiny. When I write the final chapter, that's the last you'll read of me. Today I went to see a friend. His days are almost at an end. The doctors say he's got a month or two to live. He called to me there from his bed, and with a weakening voice he said, "If there's no God, then tell me what the hell's the point." I didn't have an answer, so I looked at him and said, "You were always giving love. You could have." Taken it instead. This journey may be pointless, but at least I sure can say you made it better for the rest of us. You passed along the way, but still the stars remain the same. Together on our own cold night.
that she 